Welcome to Life Hacks with Garth Bruin, where it is my job to pass on to you the best hacks that I have found from the best in the world and utilized in my life to give more productivity, more joy, more passion, more purpose, more love in your life today, right now. Keeping it a short little video series just to give you some good bits that you can put into your life, put into action straight from the moment you hear it. Now today is life hack number four, which is hack your sleep. Now, are you getting the right amount of sleep? The right amount doesn't mean that you're getting a lot of sleep because I'm sure you found, had the experience before when you oversleep, you're tired as well. So finding the right amount of sleep for you is very important and going into your natural body clock, it's called your circadian rhythm and everything on, on this planet that's alive runs on a 24 hour clock and find out how your clock works because there's different percentages of people. There's the wolves, which are the ones who like to stay up, who naturally stay up late. That's sort of the night watch that keep keep that tribe safe during the night time. Then you've got the bears, which are the ones that have the normal sort of time going to sleep. Uh, they go to bed at sort of, you know, 10 o'clock and they'll wake up at sort of 7 a.m. sort of thing. And then you've got the lions, which are the early risers, who like to go to bed early but love waking up at 4 or 5 a.m. in the morning and they're the morning watch to keep everyone protected and safe in the morning. So it's a natural phenomenon that happens inside you, but the best thing you can do is to test it out by getting a free app. There's one called Sleep Cycle, which I use and track my sleep every single night, shows me how well I've slept and also gives you an understanding of the cycles that you're going through. And then you can change your sleep pattern too. So starting going to sleep earlier, trying that for a month, then going to sleep later and testing how good the quality of your sleep is during that time. And the other part to it as well is if you are healthy and you're meditating and your body is in a great place, then you're going to sleep less because your body doesn't need as much time. I know for me, when I'm in a healthy place of meditating, of eating right, doing exercise, all the right things, I'm, I sleep for five and a half hours. But if I am not, if I'm out of balance on pretty much any of those, any one thing of it, then I'm sleeping for eight hours. So this gives me the reason to make sure that I keep my health at a very high level so that I can sleep less but also feel better during the day from sleeping less. It's crazy, I know. But I hope you enjoyed. And of course, you know the drill. If you enjoyed this, hit the like button, comment down below. I'd love to hear what you think or share it out to somebody that you think might need this information. But stay beautiful. Have an absolutely amazing, outstanding freaking day today. I am Garth Bruin. Signing out.